Hey everybody, we are back with another review, and today we're going to be doing some He-Man and the Masters of the Universe Netflix show, the new one, the kitty one. Uh, unboxings, we're going to check out some stuff. We got Battle Cat, we're going to check out. Uh, what else do we got? We got Power Attack, He-Man. He's got like a Royal Guard type of uh, outfit on, pretty cool. Um, and then we got a 10-inch He-Man, we're going to check out. So 10-inch He-Man, why don't we start with him? We'll start off with 10-inch He-Man. Um, again, this is from the Netflix series. I do not watch this show. It's a little bit too kiddy for me, but I think some of the toys that they drop are kind of cool. Not all of them. Trust me. There's a ton that are not cool. Um, but a 10 inch He-Man is pretty cool. We also got, it took all that time to, there we go. Cut the tape muzzle. There we go. Some of the stuff's cool. Not all the stuff. Some of the He-Man stuff's really cool. They dropped the Power Sword uh, for this this series, which is nice. So you can get yourself the Power Sword from this series um, in about, uh, I think it's 24-inch, 24-inch Power Sword. So we'll just, yeah, there we go. So we got two. There we go. The other one, where is it at? Sometimes it's easier just to stretch these things so you could actually get access to the uh, the stretchies. There we go. We'll check him out in a second. Uh, it's one of those. Let's do it. We weren't going to save any of that anyway. New He-Man stuff. This is all out-of-box stuff. As you can tell, this one's a little bit more clunky. What's the age range on this one? Four plus. It's a little bit more clunky, made more for a younger child, if you would. But he is a 10 inch He Man. He's got his sword, which is a little bit different than the normal traditional sword. It's a modern version. They've got him in this huge, bulky character, which is cool. He should be bulky. He's a freaking barbarian type of a character. Um, but they made his head like overtly small, like scaled small, like he almost looks like an idiot. <laughs> like, where do we go? <laughs> I don't know. His head looks just scaled proportionally wrong, but that's the new that's the new series. This is the the proportions that people like, I guess, um, for kids in this in this modern era. He has a a sword that is able to snap on his back, which is cool. There we go. You can spin it that way, or you can spin it that way, whichever way you want to make his draw, which is pretty freaking cool. So, ten inch He Man. He's just gonna hang out for now. We'll pull over this one, which is, um, I don't actually say what the heck the name of this one is. Just a power attack, I guess. Just a power attack. So, we have all the He-Man, we have all the He-Man, uh, stuff from this wave, this wave of this TV show. I do like collecting the He-Man figures, at least from this wave. I have a couple Skeletors, but again, not too big on this show. This one I thought was super cool. It was a deluxe. He has a nice cape, which is, you know, this is a little bit higher in the age range. Oh, no, four plus on this one too. Interesting. I guess there is no small parts. So it doesn't really matter. So I guess everything is four plus. Everything's four plus. Everything is four plus. I'm looking at right now. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see how the heck this thing snaps on. I'm guessing it snaps over his gauntlet somehow like that, maybe. He's got, it's like a power fist move, maybe. Pretty cool. He does have a bendable action right here um, at the waist, which is kind of cool. And a nice snap back motion, which is kind of cool. Because he could definitely do some hack and slash. And here's his shield. It looks like it's some kind of a Grayskull Energon shield. That he's rocking right there and then there's the sword so pretty cool marching off into battle with his royal guard he-man attire and we're going to put him aside here for a second because we're going to put him on battle cat when we get battle cat out of here so let's do let's do battle cat and we'll do, man, there's a lot of these snaps. Holy crap. Get your, uh, 
what is it? Get your little pieces, that's for sure, especially if you have animals. Um, there's one thing I wanted to mention on this one. Now, this one, this one, uh, I just want to make sure that was fun. This one, they did it really good on the back. Now, look at this. This looks awesome. Look at how deep red metallic the armor is on Battle Cat. This looks freaking cool. I like this. This looks cool. I would, I would buy this, which, um, was something that I looked at when I was looking, when I was looking to buy this was this back piece. Cause I was like, you know, it looks pretty cool, man. Battle Cat looks pretty awesome. And then this is the guy they gave us. So the red's not the same. It's a little bit more of a lighter red. It's not as a deeper red. It doesn't have that metallic look to it. It has more of a, um, like a, just a regular plastic vinyl look. Now, if you look on the legs here, certain parts do look metallic. Like right here, you can see there's like a metallic spray on these plastic parts. But I think they could have done this a little better. Mouth moves, has a movable mouth, which is cool. Let's seat He-Man up atop his battle cat. Fits pretty good. Marching off to battle, he's got his Energon sword and his Energon shield. He's ready to go. And he fits on there pretty good, actually. And which is what you want, because these are, like I said, intended for kids. It looks like this is the crotch socket. You just kind of put your figure in there with the crotch kind of snapped into that part, and that kind of will hold him up, because there is no back part to hold him back here. So, but like I said, crotch, crotch rocket, crotch socket, just. And then you can drape over this little loincloth. You just lift that up and then drape it over. And there he is. Battle Cat with He-Man. Pretty cool. Um, four inch, 10 inch. Why don't you let me know down in the comments below what you think of the 10 inch He-Man, the four inch He-Man with Battle Cat with the Royal Guard armor on. Pretty dope. Um, again, not a fan of the show. But some of the pieces are pretty cool. It is cool to get a 10-inch He-Man. I mean, come on. Cool to have a 10-inch He-Man. That's pretty cool, right? So let me know down in the comments below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. One more content like this. Subscribe for more. Because reviews every single day. So we'll go for that. And have a great rest of your day.